Hi again guys, another coffee related video for you today. Uh, this one is an unboxing video of the Caflano Classic. It was delivered today in this massive, unnecessarily so, I think, um, box as you can see. And I say unnecessarily so because the item itself is this little fella right here. Um, so. Um, a little bit over the top, I think, but hey, you know, uh, that's that's what a lot of these these companies seem to do. Now, the actual packaging for the item for the Caflano Classic is very simple. It's a, a sturdy cardboard tube, recycled material, sort of recyclable. Uh, it's got all the relevant bits of information that uh, you can see there, the web details. We've got some Korean print on the back. The item, of course, is, is made in Korea. It was a crowdfunded... Um, by a, a Korean uh, entrepreneur. Um, we've got uh, all-in-one coffee maker with some nice little details on the front and some incredibly hard to read white writing printed on this. Uh, not that that's greatly important, but that is very hard to read, I've got to say. And, um, and then on the back, we've got a sort of a breakdown of the component parts, as you can see there, and uh, an itinerary of, of their purpose, uh, a list of what they do. So, the uh, the thing is sealed by this, this nice sticker with a picture on the front, which you can split with a thumbnail or with a sharp knife or something similar. Um, do make sure you have the supervision of an adult. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't have an adult. Uh, to help me, so I just I just chanced it, and, uh, and luckily I managed to cut it without cutting myself. So fingers crossed there. So we take the lid off, and inside we have pretty much filling the thing, the um, the item itself, and the instructions. We'll have a quick look at that first, and then we'll have a closer look at the Caflano itself. So it folds out like so, and essentially each of these panels contains instructions in a different language, front and rear, and it tells you everything you need to know. So over here we have um, what it is, um, a picture of the component parts and a description, and then a how to use section over here and how to clean it right at the end. Um, nothing ridiculously complicated or, uh, or untoward in there, straightforward stuff. So take this out, that's the box empty. Remove the bubble wrap that the Caflano Classic is packaged in. And there it is. It, it kind of looks like a giant tumbler, really, which it, 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 it is, sort of, but it's, it's also much more than that. It has some nice touches which I will, uh, I will mention briefly, but I will be doing a full review of it and a use of it. But for the meanwhile, what I'm gonna do is pan the camera over here and we're gonna have a closer look at it. Um, you get a good sized insulated tumbler and the components are as follows. You have a cap which unscrews on a fine thread. This is solid under here because this is, um, this is used for holding water. So that's your cap there. This portion unscrews here, like so, and you have your water container. So that's the first two bits there. On the top here you have a ceramic burr grinder for grinding whole beans with a fold-out handle. And this is adjustable on a little cam, just like the, um, the Hario grinder for example or, uh, or many many others of that same kind of design to adjust it you unscrew this remove it and turn this dial here and then lock it back in place and this gives you your adjustability for your finer or coarser grind this portion then unscrews like so that's the underside of the burr grinder that you can see there which is stamped with the name uh, but the burrs are very, very similar to uh, to the ones on my Hario Mini Burr Grinder. Similar sort of design. Um, I'm just going to pop that over here. What we have then is an etching drip filter made of plastic and very, very fine mesh. 
It's tricky to see how fine that mesh is exactly, but it is an incredibly fine mesh. The item itself is incredibly beautifully moulded. It's so, so neat. Uh, there's no rough edges, there's no little sort of gaps and that kind of thing, as you can sometimes get in drip filter machines with the built-in uh, sort of mesh filters that you get with them. So there's that portion there, and that leaves us finally with the insulated tumbler. It's stainless steel, double-walled, insulated inside, with a plastic outer, and a rubber base. Uh, a rubberized base, which makes the, this grip, whatever surface it's on, really, really well. Which is also nicely printed with the details, as you can see there, if I tilt that towards the light a little. So, that's the whole thing. It all packs into itself, and the drip filter goes on, just sits on a, on a rim inside there. The grinder screws in like so with the fold out and fold in handle. Obviously the handle folds in for storage. The lid, which can which you put your water in for brewing over there, and then this bit screws onto the top. And the only other thing sort of relevant for mentioning at this moment is that of course you can put the lid on here, on this side, and you have a little pouring spout for your water. And you can also put the lid on the tumbler itself, as I'll just very quickly show you. I'm taking that out uh, to keep your drink hot. So I'll go into a little bit more detail about that when we do the full review. And um, meanwhile, I'm going to give this a bit of a bit of a quick wash and get, get it ready for its first use. That's the Caflano Classic, uh, which appears to be a nice little compact drip filter machine that uh, is ideal for taking on, uh, on holidays, trekking, or just generally out and about. I uh, hope you found this useful. Uh, keep checking back for my full review of this, and uh, thank you for watching.